What's going on everybody? Math with Chris. Uh, more factors using factor trees today. We're going to dominate the number 90. 90, you ain't got nothing on us. Uh, first thing we do to find all the factors is bank the two easiest factors. That's 1 and the number itself, 90. All right, 90, do your worst. What two numbers can multiply together to give us 90? We can pick any combination we can think of. I'm going to go with the uh, most obvious, I would say, is 9 times 10. 9 times 10 is 90. Let's take a look at that 9. Can 9 be broken down further? Yes, sir. 9 is a perfect square, so let's unsquare that. 9 is 3 times 3. Our 3 is perfect uh, pr uh, prime numbers. They are, so circle the 3s. They're done. Left side of the tree is done. What about 10? 10. Can 10 be broken down further? Uh, it indeed can. 10, as we all know, is 2 times 5. As two a prime number? Absolutely. Is five a prime number? Absolutely. Circle them. And our tree is done. Nice and uh, nice and clean here. Any any path you take down, any branch ends in a circled prime number no matter which direction you go. That's our goal and we have uh, we have achieved the goal. So we're done with the factor tree. The prime factors are three, another three, a two, and a five. If we go ahead and put those in order, we get 2 times 3 times 3 times 5. And if you multiply those together, that does in fact give you 90 as it should. Okay, so now we can bank all the prime uh, numbers that we, we found. We found a 2, we found a 3, and we found a 5. And we can also bank any numbers we found along the way. We, we, we at one point hit a 9, we at one point stopped in and said hello to number 10. So we can bank both 9 and 10. And now the last step of the game is we come down to look at our factors down here, the prime factors. And is there any other combination of these numbers we can multiply together to give us some number not in the bank? Let's uh, go ahead and look. 2 times 3, let's start with that. 2 times 3 is 6. We don't have 6 yet, so let's go ahead and bank 6. What about 3 times 3? 3 times 3 is 9. We already got that, so don't need it. 3 times 5. 3 times 5 is 15. We don't have 15 yet. Let's put 15 in the bank. Uh, now that's all the... No, I guess we didn't try 2 times 5 yet. 2 times 5, but we already have it. Now let's try the 3-way combos. What about... 2 times 3 times 3. Uh, well, 2 times 3 times 3 is 18. We do not have 18 yet, so let's add an 18. What about 2 times 3 times 5? 2 times 3 times 5, that's in fact 30. Don't have 30 yet, let's add 30 to the mix. Uh, and what about 3 times 3 times 5? 3 times 3 times 5, if you work that out, is 45. We do not have 45 either. So add 45 to the bank, and that is every combination there is to try. Nothing else to, nothing else to give it a go at. So we're done. We found all our factors of 90. There were a bunch of them. It uh, looks like 12 in all. It should be an even number because 90 is not a perfect square, so that checks out. The factors of 90 are in order 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 10, 15, 18, did I skip 9? Let me start over. 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 9, 10, 15, 18, 30, 45, and 90. Nice try, 90, but we got you. You gave us your worst, and we knocked it out of the park. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Hope you guys found this helpful, and I hope you guys are... Uh, just dominating these factor trees by now. More videos uh, available if you need to check them out. Uh, until next time, guys.